because we've seen this before, right? The Mets are tearing things down. They are. They're tearing things down. They may move Justin Verlander too. They basically paid the Rangers to take Max Scherzer off their hands. They're being shrewd about it though. They're taking on salary to get better prospects in return. They're bribing people to take their guys and give them something. Because that's the way that baseball trades work. So I, I don't have the science. This is where somebody like Sam Flannel would struggle because there's no <laughs> there's no analytical basis to it. It's just a gut feeling, Sam Flannel. And I respect analytics. I do. There is a place for them. Numbers don't lie. Right. People lie. Numbers do not lie. I understand that. But there is a nuance. There's an art form to these things. And Sam Flannel, here's the nuance to it. It's not Alavila. Hey, I mean, Alavila, what, when you look back at the numbers for Alavila, he didn't win a single trade his whole career. I mean, we even look at the Isak Paredes Austin Meadows one. I mean, I, I saw a tweet where it was Isak Paredes has hit, has hit 40 home runs on the Rays, and Austin Meadows has played 42 games for mm. the Tigers. And I don't even need to get into what they got for JD Martinez, guys like Sergio Alcantara. Oh, no, because I have Dawa it here. Dawa yes. Lugo, yes. Sergio Alcantara, and Jose King. Jose King. And then for Verlander, it was Jake Rogers, Daz Cameron, and Franklin Perez. Has Franklin Perez ever? even pitched a pro no. professional baseball game since I don't then. Think so. I don't think so. And and look, Jake Rogers is a nice defensive catcher, has a little bit of power, but does hit 215 or whatever it is. And that but whatever. I'm not it's is that an equal return for as much salary of Justin Verlander as you ate? No. No. <laughs> no. Absolutely not. And I have people I've told you before, like my my Alavila loyalist friends that'll say, well, Jake Rogers is 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 a fine catcher. He's a good he's a good catcher. Yeah. Okay, cool. That's your prize. That's the Alavila prize return. And, uh, well, Jamer Condelario, it just, just got flipped by the National. Well, he, he wasn't here. And he wasn't here because he sucked. <laughs> he wasn't here because he was your cleanup hitter on a team that I was told was going to the playoffs. Led the league in doubles. <laughs> he was good in 2021. Yeah, exactly. yeah great. <laughs> great. Not in 2022.